This is a demonstration on how to fill the Pulsar Loop S spring type lubricator. We use a pneumatic pump to connect that to your valve. Initially, the lubricator must be in the off position at the yellow arrow. And then we will connect the lubricator to the grease gun and slowly open so that it will fill up to about 60 cc's. You then remove the lubricator off the grease gun. And then you will turn to position number five, which will allow the grease to come back out. The reason for this is to make sure that there are no air voids or air pockets at the top of the lubricator. And we make sure that the customer receives 100% lubricant. We then place the position to off and then put the lubricator Clean out the tip, put the lubricator on the tip of the grease valve, and fill. We will fill the do not fill line, or do not fill past this line. If you fill past that line, it is possible to damage your lubricator. So you fill to the line, and then place your piston clamps on either side, there are two piston clamps. After that, you will put it back to position number five to release the piston and secure it at the same time with your piston clamps. You then turn it back to off. You wipe off the tip. Then you use this tool here, which is really six millimeters in diameter, and put it through the bottom of the lubricator. This procedure is used to eliminate any messy oil separation that may occur during shipping. We then clean off the tip of the nipple at the top of the lubricator. Clean off the tip of the lubricator itself. We then put on the red cap for the nipple of the lubricator. And then we cap off the bottom of the lubricator. And you are finished.